Mrs. JJ just likes me pronouncing these because in a Scottish accent, apparently it sounds funny. You say it, you say it first. Curly whirly squirlies. Curly whirly squirlies. <laughs> <laughs> The court is now in session. What's up people? Today we've got another ranking video. I got hold of 15 Cadbury's chocolate bars this time and me and my little sister tried them all and ranked them. I think the time's right to finally introduce an idea that I've had since starting the channel a few months ago and that is the jury pool. On screen right now is the current jury pool. There's only a few people. Every time someone new comes on one of these videos, they'll be added to the jury. Eventually, once I've got a full jury, I'll organise videos that incorporates a few, if not all, of the jurors in one video. One final quick thing, a lot of my friends and family actually don't live anywhere near me, so you'll notice that the locations change, meaning the sound and lighting might be a bit different to this setting. I am looking to improve this setup moving forward as well. It's not quite as good as I'd like, the lighting's not on point, I could do with a slightly better camera, but that's enough from me, let's get straight into this one. Uh, I think we should start with your... What you think your favourite's going to be? Okay, um, probably the caramel, <coughs> the caramel one. Have you tried it? No. I haven't tried it, so the new caramel. Ladies first. You're a gentleman and a scholar. Okay, I'm sorry. My mistake. That was a woman I was talking to. Oh my god, what is that smell? nice but a lot it's not got a strong flavor it is nice it's more milky mm. come on what did you expect if it had like biscuit in it or something i think it would be better mm. but you thought that was going to be your favorite yeah because i didn't realize it was just that well it's going to be right right in the middle for now yeah i'll pick the next one okay shall i pick my favorite and see if it ends up being at the top yeah so i think star bar is my mm -hmm. favorite That's our bar. Yeah. Got quite a bit to get through, so we're only doing a little bit each. <laughs> smells proper nice. Oh my god, yeah. Oh, it's so good. And they're so soft as well. It's like you don't feel like you're doing a jaw workout, just trying to eat it. Mm. Way better than that. Mm -hmm. Where are we doing high and low? What, low over here, high over there? I pick next one. I don't know if I'm gonna struggle to eat all this chocolate because I'm more savoury. Would you say you're more savoury or more like sweet? Sweet for the most part. Well, you're quite bossy then. Um, should we get the horrible dark chocolate out of the way? Do you not like dark chocolate? No. What? 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 So we've got a Bourneville, which is dark chocolate. I don't think it's. It's not like seventy percent. Uh, strong dark chocolate but they do Bourneville orange and Michael bought me the Easter egg and he brought it home I was like this one's for you I was like you see the nice ass dark chocolate and he was like no I think I gave it away in the end didn't even bother open it that's a bit harsh everyone always gets wound up at me but I hate chocolate orange anything chocolate orange weird the orange Smarties just ruin like the whole tube. No, they're they the really only good ones in there. They ruin the whole tube. They contaminate the rest of the tube. <laughs> it wow. even stinks. It smells nice. It doesn't. It's not strong. Do you really hate that? Yeah. Ah, it's so it's really creamy. Oh yeah, that's nice and creamy. It's not. It's not that strong. I'm trying to find the percentage, but whatever it is, I like it. Is it? Worse than that for you. Yeah. 100%. Yeah. yeah. I don't know, I, I kind of like them both. I'll put it there. Do you like um, Christmas advent calendar chocolate? Yeah. That explains it. Because that's what it tastes like. Kind of does actually. <laughs> kind of cheap. Yeah. <laughs> that's nasty. Alright, I'll pick the next one. I don't think I've ever had a Whisper Gold. I don't think I have. Should we do the Whisper first and then the Whisper Gold and yeah. compare them? Yeah. Do this one. Got a plain Whisper. Cheers. It's like a flake. I don't really know why. Why do they make whisper and flake? Different texture. Kind of crumbles. Yeah. Melts in your mouth. It's tasty though. 
I think it's because you always get a Cadbury selection box. And I, I wouldn't normally like go into a shop and pick any of these. So, no. No. Um, Should we start in the middle? Is it better than the cow milk? I think it's on par with. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's on par with, I would say. Uh, Does so it have I... to go like before or after, basically? Yeah, it has to, yeah. Damn the rules. Bye. Well, what do you think? Do you think it's better or worse? I'd pick the Bourneville, but then it means... It's... You really think it's that bad? Well, no, it's that's boring. the thing. I don't think it's bad, but I prefer that, so it has to go after, like, after it, overruled and that So it's, yeah. not, it's not better than caramel milk? No. Okay. And you just think it's on par? Yeah. It's going there then. Yeah. Alright, okay. Alright, do you want to pick the next one? Fruit and nut. Again, ill. Wouldn't ever choose it. I don't think I'd choose it either. Not a huge fan of raisins and currants. Mm -hmm. I don't get any nut, I just got pure raisin. What both? It's the worst one yet though. Yeah. Worst one yet? It's very much right there. I am gonna go with these. Decent. It'll take you 10 years to chew one, but yeah. <laughs> Mrs. JJ just likes me pronouncing these because in a Scottish accent. Apparently it sounds funny. You say it, you say it first. Curly whirly. Say the full thing. Curly whirly, what are they? Curly whirly squirrelies. Curly whirly squirrelies. <laughs> <laughs> right! What do you mean you're not doing bastards in part of us? We didn't get a full curly whirly. Probably making loads of noise. Probably can't even hear what I'm saying. Full curly whirly bar. But if you haven't had it before, toffee and chocolate. Big fan of coffee myself. Thanks. Just straight in. Yeah. No messing around. Little pieces. <laughs> proper stuck on my teeth. It is. It's one of them like I get bored eating it because it's that much of a chore, but it tastes so good. Hmm. I really like toffee, but I know what you mean. It is a bit of a chore to eat. Mm -hmm. You wouldn't be. <laughs> Busting these out whilst watching a film because you wouldn't hear anything. All you hear is <laughs> it's yourself chewing. I probably put that, it above caramel. Really? Okay. There's a bit more to it. It's not just plain. You know, there's something else in there. True. Yeah, I reckon. Yeah, I'd go with that. I'll just put it next to it for that. Yeah. Who picked that? That was me. Do you want to pick the next one? Double decker. Oh my gosh, it is a double decker. I cannot believe it. When I was a kid, I could never finish one of these. They're so dense. Yeah, yeah there is a lot going on. <laughs> if you've never had a double decker, don't know if you can see the cross section there. Nope. But yeah, nougat. Nougat? You're team nougat, right? Instead mm -hmm. of a nugget. Yeah, nougat. Yeah. yeah, nougat. I mean, like, crispy biscuit? Yeah, crispy bits. Like l little mini Malteser bits. Yeah. That's really nice. Mm. The new guys, cheap taste to You think? Yeah, but new, yeah, all new guys. Do you like the pink and white new guy bars? With no nuts, yeah. <laughs> no nuts. I'd put that below Curly Valley's. It is completely different to Curly Whirly. Yeah. Uh, I'd say it's a bit better. Okay. You, what you're saying is just slightly worse. It's the flavour. Just too synthetic, too yeah. fake. Yeah. I like all the different textures though. I can appreciate that. Mm. I reckon it's just above it, you know. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I thought we were going to do Whisper Gold after Whisper. Yeah, we definitely didn't do Whisper Gold straight up after Whisper, did we? No. Should we do that? Yeah. I thought it was uh, a bit like a crunchy, which we have in a second, but apparently it's just like whisper with a caramel. That's what I would have assumed, yeah. Sorry. F*** me, right? Just looks like the same flaky chocolate. I've definitely just dropped chocolate all over my laptop. Uh, but with caramel on it. Cheers. Cheers. That's quite a big bit, sorry. That is, I know. <laughs> you know what, I think that's decent. 
because because it's got air bubbles, it's not as heavy as like a dairy milk caramel. Because it is actually really sickly. Yeah. But then, because it's lighter, mm. bubbly, makes it easier to eat. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I could finish one though, personally. Mm. It is really it's like I don't know why, but it's way more sweet than anything else so far. Mm -hmm. Well, wow, yours is, you've got the sweet tooth. I would struggle to even eat that. So let's put it above normal. Yeah, I know you'd put it above born though. That would be in the bin if you ask me. <laughs> yeah. Get in the bin. Get in the trash can. Get in the skip. But you wouldn't put it above caramel. No. It's just got above the normal whisper then. Yeah. Boom. What do you want next? Picnic is crunchy, chewy, fruity feast. So we've got fruit in it again. I hate fruit, but I love a picnic. Yeah, I feel, I have not had one in probably years, but mm. I, I think I feel the same. Does it, does it, <laughs> <laughs> does it look the most appetizing? <laughs> To be fair, I obviously, it's got crispy bits in it as well. Yeah, that's what I was literally about to say. When I'm eating chocolate, I don't sit there with a knife and cut it in pieces. No. But we've just noticed, both of us have just noticed for the first time, it's got the same biscuit pieces, which you definitely can't see, uh, that are in the double decker. That's banging. Mm -hmm. Even though it says it's got fruit in it, you can't tell it's got fruit in it, it just tastes chewy. I think that's why it tastes much better than. That or something. I've put That's, it above double. Yeah. Check us agreeing. <laughs> yeah, no arguments from me. <laughs> Spot on. Right, I'm gonna pick Crunchy next. This is Mrs. JJ's favourite chocolate bar. No, it's not. <laughs> yeah, it is. Wow. Put some respect on my name. You understand me? When y'all saying my name, put some respect on The best way I can describe it. If you're not from the UK and you don't know what crunchy is, or if you know what uh, Butterfinger is, that's Butterfingers are far nicer though. This is honeycomb. Butterfinger is obviously the same sort of brittle texture, but peanut flavour. Like Butterfinger, I think almost melts in your mouth. Crunchy, it's hard and it gets stuck in your teeth. When was the last time you had one? Maybe they changed the recipe? Only ever at Christmas time. Because <laughs> you get a selection like box. box. <laughs> it's the only reason I've ever eaten one. Yeah, but I think it's like crumble, don't they? This is just like rock hard. Yeah. It's a lot thicker as well, maybe that's why, because it's a lot thicker. Yeah. So you've got thick, brittle. Sister in law getting insulted in three, <laughs> two, <laughs> one. It's just boring. <laughs> There's so much honeycomb, not enough chocolate. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of the soz. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm not sorry. It is. It's, it's weird, isn't it? Because you'd think, from the description, you'd be like, oh, that sounds really good, but it's just not for me. No. I mean, it's better than fruit in that. No? Not for me. Really? No. I'd say it's better than fruit in that, but... Worse than Whisper. Whisper's nice, light, yeah. airy chocolate. So, it's down there. Sauce hun. Your pick? Um, boosty Woosty. Boosty Woosty. So like I said a minute ago, I think this basically tastes exactly like a star bar, but with no peanut flavour. A delicious pile of tastes. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Thanks for that. <laughs> um, uh, the description is milk chocolate with caramel and biscuit. Where's the caramel at? That's just... Oh, it's around the edge there. Oh, right, yeah. That's... That's not biscuit in the middle, is it? That's what? soft. Just one little bit, and that little white bit. <laughs> really? <laughs> 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 that white bit's the biscuit. <laughs> you can't be serious, man. You cannot be serious! <laughs> Was that a national biscuit talk or something? <laughs> anyway, let's give it a go. So soft. It was so good. Well, no messing around, it's up the top, isn't it? You were pointing at the picnic. Is it better or worse than the picnic? Better. 
I think we're, yeah. So we, t we have got pretty similar tastes overall. Mm. I just like dark chocolate, you don't. Yeah. We've got four more to go. Twelve, because it seems a bit, seems like such a pointless chocolate bar. Used to be one of the well, fives. Yeah. Like the cup of tea. Now then, who's for tea? Uh, not that this is pointless, but to have the selection that they do, to have Flake, which yeah. we've not tried yet, but it's crumbly chocolate. Whisper, which is crumbly. To just have Flake. They are so different though, aren't they? Are they? Whisper's like Aero. That's what it's called, right? Aero, yeah. Yeah. Flake, I love them, but oh my god, it's so much mess. That's why I'd always go over 12, because it's a flake. You know? <laughs> well, some people might not know, but... You've not seen the flake yet, you'll see that in a bit. It's a clean and tidy flake. This is encased in chocolate. <laughs> flake is kind of tree bark, looks like tree bark. <laughs> yeah. Okay, this is great. It instantly just falls apart. So good. It's one of them like, sometimes I feel like I want chocolate with something else. And other times I feel like I need chocolate and I need it right now, like I need a hit. That'd be a decent chocolate fix with it. Yeah, because you know like a dairy milk, like a solid dairy milk. It's yeah. too hard, it doesn't melt in your mouth and it's just, that is really boring. That's like in the middle in it between being a bit quirky but just being chocolate at the same time. I kind of know what you mean, like if you had a dairy milk, you fancy chocolate bit. You're just gonna sit there and suck on a cute, like a square of it. Yeah. This is maybe you're on the go. Mm -hmm. and you're like, oh, I need some chocolate right now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I get you. I just wouldn't ever pick it though. Because I don't have the sweet tooth. If I'm, if I'm on the go, I'm not like, oh, I need chocolate right now. Yeah. You take sugar. No, thank you, Turkish. I'm sweet enough. So it's hard for me. I'll ask you, where would you put it? And then. I don't know, I'll just see. I would probably put it in there. Above Bourneville. Well, obviously not so, above Bourneville in my head, <laughs> but I know that you're not going to move on that, so. <laughs> so it's better than Whisper, even though it's kind of similar in texture? Yeah, because I don't find them similar. Okay. Uh, well, I mean, that's lucky, because I think Twelve's better than Whisper. <laughs> <laughs> but not as good as Bourneville. Duh. No, sorry. Basically, every single one that's just under Bourneville, it doesn't exist to you, it's not there. Yeah, so we are somewhat so agreeing. We have agreed. Yeah. It's not as good as caramel. So, should we put it over the Bourneville? Yeah, let's do that, just hide that. <laughs> right, three more to go. Gonna go for caramel. Have you noticed that all the chocolate bars have changed their design? It's like. Bubbles. Round bubble circular pieces used to be cubes. Don't know why they. Well, giving us less chocolate. That's what probably is. I kind of want to squeeze one of these because it's filled with caramel, right? <laughs> I'll zoom in on that. <laughs> Lush. <laughs> It's not just me, right? I know we've ate quite a lot, like quite a bit of chocolate already, but it's so sickly, isn't it? It's like tarmac in your mouth. <laughs> Those classic weekends eating tarmac. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just feel like I need to brush my teeth after mm. only one one piece. You need like ice cold water over that. Yeah. It's not that it's not tasty, it's, it's it is nice, really but... Nice. The caramel is really nice, really smooth soft and caramel, sweet. caramel, yeah. But... I feel like I've just ate a spoonful of sugar basically. Yeah. And that's why I wouldn't pick that up either. I wouldn't, I wouldn't pick that up. No. Just a bit boring. The fruit and nuts getting a lot of hit. It's because it's crap. It's not, it's not the best. <laughs> but is that worse? No. Okay. Uh, better or worse than crunchy? Better. Right. Whisper? Worse than whisper. 
Well, I'm going to look out for Mrs. JJ. It's going under crunchy. <laughs> it's not. Uh, it's not as bad as a, as um. It's not as good as a crunchy. Okay. Crunchy is a little bit better. Completely different, but yeah. Right, two more to go. We got the. We got a flake and dairy milk Oreo. What do you want to do? Should we do a flake first? Because I feel like Oreo is probably going to be the better out of the two, so it's a good one to end on. Okay. And we've obviously spoke about the flake already. Yeah. Popped it up. If you love chocolate and you love trees, <laughs> it looks like a big twig. We both know someone who would break it up in the packet and then, and then just... pour it straight in their mouth. Yeah. I don't know whether they're a weirdo or that's a thing, but but yeah, this is what I was saying. Couldn't even cut off a piece. There's still some chocolate there, but flake is just falling yeah. to bits. Do you want to take some bits? Thank you. There's two. There's no two ways about it. It's just, it's exactly the same as a twirl. It's not. No, in, in, like the inside of a twirl. Yeah. But not as good because it hasn't got the chocolate on the outside. It makes it dry. If that makes sense. That makes no sense. Um, that does make no sense. It's still nice chocolate. It is. I mean, I think that's a perfect description. The inside of a twelve is that. Yeah. And sleep a twelve? Yeah. Doesn't make really a lot of sense if it goes anywhere else. Well, underneath a twelve, but did you prefer whisper? Probably not. No? Yeah, I, yeah, I probably agree. Like I said, you clearly can't see the... Uh, Ranking very well on camera, but I'll put it on the screen at the end. We've got one last one. Dairy milk Oreo. Had quite a long journey driving over here, and this one might have got melted on the way. Look. What? Mind blown. <laughs> <laughs> what a moron. It even tells you, kill me. <laughs> yeah, but I don't read. <laughs> you can tell they know it's bad for you because they make the squares smaller. Like that's going to make a difference. It's full of Oreo. Uh, you, can, you know, even though it's not melted right now, it's in a. You can tell it's been melted. Yeah. It just kind of bend. Yeah. That's good. It's really sickly, but that's good. Yeah. I'm going to let you decide where that goes. Well, are you going to even disagree with me, depending on what I say? <coughs> yeah. Uh, I'll talk you through the list. So, I think it's better than the two plain bars of dark chocolate, Bonneville, and the caramel. Yeah. But I don't think it's better than a picnic. Um, so, it's either above or below the double decker. And you didn't like the texture of double decker. And I'd probably agree that maybe a dairy milk or whatever. Above Double Decker? Yeah. Do you think it's better than Picnic? Yeah. It's one of them, isn't it? Like, like you say, it's so sickly that if I wanted a chocolate fix, I probably would pick up a Picnic so that I could mm. eat more chocolate. <laughs> if that makes sense. Tactics. I am the one, the way your time don't need a um, But taste-wise, I thought that was pretty, pretty up there. Yeah, one tiny square would do me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like I couldn't eat any more of that. I'm bored already. Not bored, but you know what I mean. So, Maybe it's just because we've had all that though. You probably have a bit more. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, I, yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm happy yeah, with that. Yeah. So, about double decker. Boom. Done. 